Welcome to Bikey Online for Libraries. Bikey is a powerful and personalized language learning system that locks foreign language words and phrases into your memory so that you can recall them perfectly and remember them forever. Language experts call this approach declarative learning and agree that it is the most important aspect of language acquisition. More than just software, the Bikey system is also a collection of web resources and a community that lets learners create vocabulary lists and share their learning with each other. When you've logged in, Bikey Online will default to the preferred language that you selected during the registration process, but you can easily switch to any of the many languages offered in Bikey Online. The Select List screen allows you to select any list to learn in your chosen language. Select the list you want to learn and then click Open. Disculpeme. Bikey Online will open the chosen list directly to review it. This is the first of the five Bikey learning steps. In Review It, you will see both your native language and the language you are trying to learn on the same side of the card. Buenas noches. The sound for each word or phrase will automatically play as the card is shown. Disculpeme. You can move forward or backward within the list using the arrow buttons. The Step Percentage Complete Meter shows how close you are to finishing the current learning step. The List Percentage Complete Meter shows your overall progress with the current list. The Slow Sound feature is accessed by clicking on the Turtle button. Slow sound plays words and phrases slower than normal speech, Disculpeme. making it easier for you to focus on individual sounds. You can choose how much slow sound reduces the speed of the spoken words and phrases. When a learning step is complete, you will see the Congratulations dialog, showing you that the list in the current learning step has been complete. Click the Done button. This will bring you to the Learning Steps screen, where you can choose to use your currently selected list in a different learning step without having to complete any of the other steps. No. In Recognize It, the card will show the word or phrase in the language you are trying to learn. You should say or think of the answer and use the flip card button to see if you were correct, then answer yes or no. Gracias. Don't worry if you don't get the answer right away. Gracias. You will get another chance until you get it right. Bien, ¿y usted? You can also skip a card if you would like Disculpeme. to move the card further down the list. You will see it again at a later time. No. Know it will show you the foreign word or phrase. You now need to type the equivalent in your native language. After entering the text, click on the check button to see if you were correct. Por favor. If you answered incorrectly, the previous card will be displayed again. You can use the Use as Alternative Answer checkbox when you type something that is close enough to be considered correct. Once you add an alternative answer, both it and the standard answer will both be considered correct. Produce it is much like recognize it, except in this learning step, you will be shown terms in your native language and should say or think of the word or phrase in the language you are learning. Adios. Adios. In the final step, own it, you will see the terms in your native language and you should type the answer in the language you are learning. To type special characters, simply hold the control key on your keyboard and press the up or down key until you get the desired character. You may also click on the key mapper button to display the keyboard you need to use to enter the text. Disculpeme. For some languages such as Chinese or Japanese, special scripts are needed. Please click here to learn more about typing accents, special scripts, or Asian characters. When you have reached a score of 7 on all cards within the list, the list is considered learned. The items from that list are then moved to My Learned Items. The My Learned Items tab allows you to see the status of the cards you have learned so far. You'll notice that your learned items are divided into two groups, fresh and stale. When a card has been recently practiced, it is considered fresh, because the knowledge is likely to be fresh in your mind. When a card has gone unseen for a while, it becomes stale, where it possibly needs to be refreshed in your memory. Gracias. If you want additional practice for the words or phrases in any list, the Activities tab has a variety of learning activities to help you retain the words and phrases you learn in the Flashcards tab. To start any activity, click on the button for that activity. No. Multiple Choice Recognize It tests your comprehension by asking you to match the information from side 2 of your cards with the correct side 1 information in a multiple choice format. Hola. Multiple Choice Produce It allows you to confirm your comprehension by matching the information from side 1 of your cards with the correct side 2 information in a multiple choice format. Hola. 
You would see the term in your native language and have to choose one of several foreign translations. Gracias. In pronunciation, you can record your own pronunciation and compare it to the native speakers. This activity is currently only available in the Internet Explorer for Windows browser. Please note that this activity requires the use of an external microphone. Use the play button to hear the word or phrase. Disculpeme. Then click and hold the record button to record your voice. Disculpeme. Release the button when you're done recording. Disculpeme. After your voice has been recorded, you can see how your pronunciation compares to that of the native speaker. You can sharpen your listening skills and spelling by typing the words and phrases that you hear with dictation. Lo siento. You will hear a word or phrase from your list pronounced. Listen carefully to the pronunciation. When you think you know the word or phrase, type it in the space provided. To hear the pronunciation again, click play as many times as you want. Lo siento. Lo siento. Lo siento. In addition to the Bikey lists themselves, Bikey Online for Libraries provides additional material to enrich your language learning experience and further help you learn. The overview provides a background for each language. Topics that will be covered in the overview may include vocabulary, formal and informal address, and pronunciation. The Transparent Language blogs are a substantial and constantly updated resource for any language learner interested in culture and applied language. Word of the Day will help you as a learner to increase your vocabulary one word at a time. Test gives you a chance to measure how much of the language you have learned. The tests are based on basic vocabulary and grammar that you would find in any language learning course. These tests are for self-evaluation purposes only. Please note that the blogs, word of the day, and test features are not available for all languages. You can follow Transparent Language on Twitter to add another dimension of immersion for the language you are learning. Learn new words, grammar points, and a bit of culture from the daily tweets. Transparent Language's Facebook pages are a lot more than just social networking. They represent a centralized location for many of our free learning resources. Word of the Day is available on Facebook pages, as well as blog articles from our language blogs. Get content, share experiences, ask questions, and meet language experts and other learners, all in one place.